Our baby was diagnosed with positional plagiocephaly and he's getting a helmet. What is positional plagiocephaly? Positional plagiocephaly, also referred to as deformational plagiocephaly, is just a fancy word for flat head. After research and careful consideration, we decided the best treatment for our baby was a cranial remolding orthosis, otherwise known as a helmet. We visited the CAPSKids.org website and searched the provider directory for an orthotist in our area. CAPS Kids made it easy because their providers are pre-qualified. CAPS pre-qualifies the orthotists by surveying the practice, patient feedback, and outcome. It was easy to find someone we trusted. Our first visit was a free consultation. We met with the orthotist and filled out some paperwork. The orthotist took some measurements and gave us some valuable information. We asked all the questions that we found on the CAPS Kids website. He explained everything to us and we felt very confident that we had found a trustworthy and reliable place to have our baby cared for. So we went ahead and started the process. First was the initial scan of our baby's head. These scans are done in different ways but typically only take a few seconds and are considered very accurate. Ours was done by a handheld scanner. First, the orthotist put a cap on our baby's head so that the shape of the skull would be accurate. Next, the orthotist used the scanner to take measurements. The orthotist explained that they would use the scan, send it off to the cranial remodel band manufacturer, and our baby's helmet would be custom created just for him. We were anxiously waiting for the call that our baby's cranial band was ready, and when we got the call, we were excited to start the treatment. We made our appointment for the very next day. At the initial fitting, the orthotist took more measurements of our baby's head. He then began the process of the fitting. He put the cranial band on and then took it off and then put it on again, making sure that it laid exactly where it was supposed to. The cranial band is snug, but our baby seemed content. The orthotist explained that the cranial band would keep pressure off of the flattened area and put slight pressure on the areas that bulged. He showed us how to take the orthosis on and off. He explained the wearing schedule, cleaning instructions, and follow-up schedule. We left the office with our baby in his orthosis, happy and smiling. We are fortunate that our questions were answered and treatment was made available to us. Our son is only five months old, so he has an excellent chance for very favorable results. Our son is happy and thriving. The cranial remodel band has not changed him at all. In fact, we have had a really good time decorating it. If you think that there is something wrong with the shape of your baby's head, ask questions. Get online and check out the CAPSKids.org website. We are happy that we did.